The EU sent an eighth flight of humanitarian aid to Gaza on November 7 as Commissioner Yanis Lenarsik promised more support but said access was key to it reaching the most vulnerable. The flight of mostly medical supplies from Belgium's Ostend airport was loaded on Tuesday morning and was due to leave for Egypt, Lenarsik said. Questioned by journalists he said he was confident they would reach Gaza's civilian population without falling into the hands of Hamas, Gaza services are close to breaking. Point without fuel supplies, the UN Humanitarian Office said on Tuesday. Gaza's Interior Ministry said on Tuesday all bakeries in northern Gaza are out of service due to Israeli attacks and lack of fuel. This um, eight flights are the first batch. There will be further flights uh, in the coming weeks. And of course, we'll continue this uh, as long as necessary. Uh, there, are, there is emergency, humanitarian emergency in the Gaza Strip. There is shortage of everything, of water, of food, of medicines, medical equipment, of fuel. And we need to use every tool available that we have in order to provide this necessary assistance. Everybody knows who supports Hamas. Uh, and this is not the EU. And uh, the European Union assistance, be it humanitarian or development assistance, has always reached its destination. When, when it is humanitarian assistance, we work with our humanitarian partners, who are trusted partners, who have st st strong safeguards in place in order to ensure that the assistance reaches the people who need it. There have been never any credible indications or uh, proofs, let alone proofs, that European humanitarian aid has ended in the wrong hands.